Hi everybody, we are today in 2018 and uh, this is a smartphone, Samsung Galaxy Note 3, which today is an old generation smartphone. And this is a last generation PC laptop, which is a Dell XPS 13. Uh, it's not easy to connect an old generation smartphone through USB uh, cable to uh, to a last generation uh, PC laptop, as uh, as you can see now, I would try to do that, but it doesn't work. So I use the original uh, USB cable, Samsung, and I will connect my phone to the PC through the USB three port, which is here. Okay, and now see what happened. So we wait for some seconds. Okay, this is a message uh, uh, showing that the, the smartphone is not recognized. So what to do? On the web, you can find several solutions turning around um, downloading uh, drivers, uh, downloading also uh, the software from Samsung, which is called Samsung Key S3, but it does not work, it does not work for me. So I will show you two hardware techniques through a cable to solve the problem. So let's remove this cable. First solution, you can use a OTG uh, cable, USB, USB to USB-C, as you can see. This is uh, often uh, delivered with a recent smartphone to use the OTG uh, functionality. So what? you do is uh, first you take your Note 3, the original Samsung cable, you plug it on the OTG cable, okay, and then on my PC I will connect it to the Thunderbolt port which is uh, here. You can see the Thunderbolt port compatible with the USB uh, C. And now we can see our phone, and you can access to all of your uh, folder uh, inside your phone. I stayed in the MTP mode. Uh, one important thing is that uh, I didn't uh, played on the on the development option debugging USB. This is not activated, and it works or it works also. It works without that. Okay, this is the first solution. Now I show you the second one. Unplug. We remove all this cable. And I take another cable. This is a, a cable a USB to USB uh, uh, C, which is uh, found on uh, many devices. This one comes from uh, my headset, my Bose uh, headset. It is used to, to charge uh, the, the device. So what I do is plug the USB-C on the Samsung, not 3. Okay. And the USB on the USB-3 port of the 
and now you can see also oh sorry i have to okay you can see your phone here which is full of data <laughs> And you can access at any of your folder and transfer data and so on, what you want. These are two very simple solutions, quick solutions. So I hope it will help, it will be helpful for you. Bye-bye.